Hey everyone, my name is Joe Scar, and today we're going to take a look at a new free TP script operator called 2VEC Alignment. 2VEC Alignment is a tool for aligning particles using only two directions. Here we've got a simple tripod helper, and it's currently aligned to the world. You can see the world axis down here. We import that into TP with object particle, use its shape, and here in this next rule we'll go ahead and see how to use this. I should note that you have to add this script to your Mac startup scripts directory, um, and we'll cover that at the end of this video. And once you restart Max after doing that, you'll now have under helpers, M3D math, 2VEC alignment. 2VEC alignment, it's got two rollouts, one for the description, tells what it does, how it does it, what to watch out for, also the license information. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and use this to control the alignment of the particle. You can also use it just to generate a generic alignment that you can modify for any other purpose. Connect this into here. And right now, edit on the fly is off, so we'll get real-time updates. And if you see that it's got the x-direction input and the y-direction in the alignment output. What it does is it takes those two uh, directions, calculates the cross product, orthonormalizes it, and then returns that as a squared out alignment. Here we've got a 0.3 that just represents the x direction and a 0.3 re representing the y direction. We plug the x into the x direction, this y into the y direction, and as you would expect, our particle kind of sits there and is currently pointing in those directions. If we take the y value for the x direction and increase it, remember the x direction goes this way. And right now it's pointing directly out this way. If we start to add a little more in the Y portion of it, the particle will rotate like this. Okay, that's all, that's all good and fun. Let's go ahead and flip these around. We want the particle's X direction to be pointing in the Y direction. So the red will point out this way. And then let's take the, our X.3 and use that as our Y direction. So our red will point here, our green will point here, and where do you think the Z is going to point? Well, if you said down, you're right. So X points towards Y, Y points towards X, and it flips around. Now this is a very simple case, but there's actually a much more complex case involving um, objects doing shape uh, deformation, where you can have particles attached to the surface maintaining their proper alignment we're going to do a, a more complicated video on that later this week. Now, in order to get this script into your uh, TP system, you need to check your system paths. Find out where your startup scripts are and put this script inside there. Uh, another handy Mac script way to do that is simply this command that we have here, which is get dir pound startup scripts. It'll tell you where that is. All right, so give it a try, and uh, we'll see you soon.